All right, guys. So today, I got a brand new Ford Raptor R. We're gonna open this thing, we're gonna take a look. I'm gonna grab my dad's slash down, we're gonna take a look at the differences. See how close it really is to a slash and how far off it is. Let's see how long I can get this to take off without a knife. Of course, I don't think to grab one. model you your TQI radio well, as in most VXL Traxxas models anyways Truck. As you can see on most trucks, this truck has that cellophane over it, so let's get the body off of it. And it's red and it looks absolutely just beautiful. So I know the lighting's kind of crap in here, but I just wanted to get a quick look at this truck and the unboxing done. Body is very realistic with the mirrors. The mirrors do not fold, so I can see those possibly breaking. And then there's your clipless system. This truck is pretty nice the way they did the clipless system. They kind of made it not look so obvious. They use this front top scoop piece as the piece to hold to, which is awesome. So it doesn't look too bad on the top of the body, kind of like how the X Max has all the caging and stuff over it, kind of looks weird. Here is the truck, and that thing is huge actually, it's pretty long. So here's my X Max, it is almost as long as the X Max. That kind of gives you an idea on the length. You are using the same concept as like a slash 4x4 um, as the Haas. It's the kind of the Max, I guess. But more like the Haas slash 4x4, the Russell 4x4, all those 4x4 trucks that tracks the cells. Same type of honeycomb chassis. It is just way stretched. It's not as wide as like your slash chassis. Um, and then it does have these, but I mean, this truck looks really beefy it's using a lot of the Traxxas HD parts which is nice which would explain that uh, $529 price point I know when this truck came out a lot of people had a problem with that price point and you know it is fairly expensive for a 110 scale RC truck it's $529.99 plus tax I think it's about $580 here locally to me in Minnesota so yeah you're spending a little bit of money on it but when you really really think about it you're getting basically Haas or slash 4x4 but it's got HD parts on it already so the 100 bucks that's where your 100 extra hundred dollars is really kind of coming from from what I've heard um, and the arms and stuff on this do look exceptionally thick which is nice suspension actually feels pretty good out of the box too not gonna lie but those will be busted down in no time those cheap tracks the shocks so uh, yeah guys this is my unboxing my first look at it Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. I will have a running video of this truck very, very soon here. As soon as I can get one, I will get one done. Thank you, guys.